Hey guys, Dire Wolf Game, Dire here, and welcome back to another video where today we are going to be playing some. Danganronpa. Oh, hell yeah, perfect timing. You see what I did there? Yes, I know. This is uploaded very close to the latest Danganronpa stream I've done. I don't care. I feel like playing more Dong Dong Rumpa and that stream was already like three hours, I just had to. And now we get to chill with people. Should be free time, I guess. <coughs> I think. <coughs> to uh, sleep? I'm going straight to sleep, I guess. Dot, dot, dot. Uh. Oh. You right, Makoto? <clears throat> How did I get 80? How did I get 80 Monokuma coins? Can I have more? I would, I would like having more Monokuma coins. I'm just searching all around. I need them one of the points. Oh, so here's where I have to go. Dot, dot, dot. <clears throat> it's gone. Dot, dot, dot. She, she really is gone. She is gone. Yay. And I'm happy about it. Psyche's existence has disappeared without a trace. True, Psyche said. After the class trial, we took the elevator back up. To back up, Monokuma told us. Uh huh. Oh, I almost forgot. Since the class trial is over, I'll go ahead and dispose of all the corpses. What are you gonna do? It's okay. It's okay, no need to thank me. Just seeing your delighted smiling faces is enough thanks f is f thanks enough for me. After all, nobody wants to look at a rotting corpse every day. That can't be good for your health. Yeah, it definitely can't. Yeah. <laughs> His laughter style changes every damn time. I didn't even have time to mourn Sayaka or Junko's deaths. Ha <laughs> ha, idiot. I'm sure that's exactly why he did it. It's a bad joke, a sickening dream. But I have to accept reality. I have to accept the reality of it all. I headed back to the dining hall to meet up with the others. Isn't it night? Did he stay up all night? Sorry, I'm late. So, um. Hey, you okay, Makoto? Listen to me! You sure took your sweet, you sure took your sweet time. I was just about to go and get you and drag you back here. Sorry. Hmm. So, what happened? <laughs> just screaming next second. So, what happened? Your, was your room fixed up, like you said? <laughs> I imagine it would be pretty hard to sleep with a rotting corpse in your bathroom. Hey, come on. Yeah. Jesus, that's fucked up, man. Why would you say something like that? My room was spotless. There was there wasn't anything left. Like the whole thing never happened. I see. It must be tough staying there knowing what happened. Why don't you just stay in Saika's room? Because she's dead. Well, staying there and her scent still hanging in the air would hurt just as much. Plus, I've decided that I can't turn away from her death. Hmm. I could have. Um. Hey, cheer up. Getting depressed isn't gonna help anything, right? That's going to feed Monokuma with your despair. If all we, if we all work together, I'm sure we'll find a way out of here. You got it. So just everyone try to try and cheer up and get back on track. <laughs> Is that honestly supposed to make us feel better? Yes. Huh? huh? We were already working together and yet someone was still murdered. Anyone could betray us at this point. No, now, now that it's happened once, it's a question of when, not if, the next time 
one takes place. <laughs> yeah, because Sayaka made the first move. Dot, dot, dot. Well. Ah. Ugh. But if we work together against the mastermind, <laughs> nobody will have any reason to do something like that. Stop talking. Keep telling yourself that I'll be over. I'll be over here in the real world. Working together, fighting the common enemy. Like it or not, that's it's not that simple. Um, what do you mean? Are you okay with this? The Mastermind seems to be so much more powerful than we ever ever suspected. They took over heap hopes, heaps peak. They took over heaps peak. They took, took over Hope's Peak, which was supposed to be well defended, then modified it a bit, then modified it to fit their desires. The, they created Monokuma, which seems to be incredibly advanced, and they are providing out every need. need. Wait a minute. I might have just, I might have just thought of something. Oh, I'm a genius, guys. And the cherry on top, it's the execution we witnessed. Honestly. Everything has planned, everything has been planned down to the last excruciating detail. This is not, this is not the work of your everyday psychopath. Defying them may be too great of a risk. So then. Then what are we supposed to do? Anyone who truly does want to escape we'll just have to follow the rules <laughs> in which case the only option is to deceive those around you and win the game N no no what no no what I, I can't take it i don't want to live if it means killing somebody else to do it i don't want to kill anyone else well, if I had to kill someone else to live, I'd kill them even if I didn't have to kill them to live because there's some people that I just want to kill. I don't have a problem, you do. Huh? Anyone else? What do you mean? It's because... Leon lied because we all voted for him, right? Oh, I said lied. I meant died. Leon died because we all voted for him, right? <coughs> it's no different from us from us killing him ourselves. But. But. So, um. If you hadn't voted for him, then we all would have died instead, right? Then it would be like you all killing each other. It's even worse. That isn't what you wanted, is it? So it would seem. She's right. If you heap that kind of, if you heap that kind of blame on yourself, you'll turn into a full-fledged masochist. Dot, dot, dot. To hear her listen. You're not to blame, not you, not Leon, and not Sayaka. The mastermind is responsible for everything that's happened. We had no choice but to vote. We can't, I can't imagine what would have happened to us if Reed refused. Oh, no, don't. Stop. Okay, there. <coughs> and in the end, it was Monokuma who ultimately killed Leon. Actually, no, it was that, um, it was that machine thing that shot out the balls rapidly. I don't play baseball, I don't know what it's called. I play good things like cricket and video games. So don't waste your anger on yourself. Instead, direct it at the mastermind. Ding dong, bing bong, it's at night time now. Night time. <clears throat> this has night such time. soon the door to the time. dining hall. Oh, it was totally obvious before that you were trying to make yourselves feel better and justify what you did. See you, see you, don't see you, see you. That's about how much I can see you even when you try to hide. Okay, guys. I pointed this out on stream, but no one was at, on the stream at the time. I don't think anyone watched far enough. You can't see where I'm put like arrows on stream. So Monokuma, the bright part behind Monokuma, that's his chair. But the parts to the right and left, you can't see him making contact with that. If like you see his whole body, right? 
He wouldn't need a chair that big. Plus it's facing in the direction of two monitors. Two like laptops, right? That's a person. That's a person. Right there. That's a person. I'll put some arrows there, I might zoom in on it. It's definitely a person. I can tell you that. Now pay attention and remember this well. The burden of judging others is a heavy one to bear. So be well aware <laughs> of your actions. <laughs> okay, Monokuma, you got me with that one. Order and stability rely on the sacrifice and responsibility of everyone. Okay then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. <laughs> what was that about just now? He was saying it was our fault what happened? That's pretty cruel, Don't man. Fuck with me. That piece of shit. Who does what he think? What? Who does? What? Well, I didn't. I didn't read that. To crap. Shit. Fuck. Fucking fuck. Why? Our despair has only just begun. Boy's life of despair. Chapter two. Okay, this one's gonna be a surprise because I actually don't know what's up in chapter two. Okay, lift your arms up and down. Whoa, they've got PE class. Hey. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now reach way up. And bend way down. Tighten those muscles. Let's add a little strength, a little speed to those young bodies of yours. I like how the on only one doing it is Taka. <sighs> Doesn't this just feel great being stuck inside like this? You sure got to make sure to stay healthy. <laughs> You're the one who's keeping us stuck inside. <laughs> don't sweat the small stuff. Oh, don't sweat the small stuff. That's my motto. Yeah Whoa, that... What do you think? Die, Monokuma. Shine. So? So why did you call us here? Certainly it wasn't to make us... Just to make us exercise. It yeah. probably was. Just to make you exercise? Just to make you exercise? Hey! If exercise makes you laugh, exercise will make you cry. What? No. Now, if you now if you keep doing these exercises, you'll uncover the secret of the assassin's fist. <laughs> Passed down from generation to generation in the Empire of Darkness, the power can be yours. Hmm? That sounds kind of like it. That sounds kind of like. That sounds like the kind of junk a middle schooler would come up with. It doesn't matter. Just get to the point. It doesn't matter. Just get to the point. Did you really call us down here just to exercise? Hey, um. Of course not. You think you think I have the kind of free time? That kind of free time on my hands? We did just make us exercise. Okay, so then... Hmm. Ah, I'd like to make an announcement. Every time you overcome a class trial here at Hope's Peak Academy, a whole new world will open up to you. What the heck? A whole new world? You guys! It'd really suck if you had to live here forever with nothing to s new to stimulate you. Besides, I know, I know you kids these days got... W days with your ADD and ADHD, I gotta keep you motivated. Very nice. So go ahead and look around where you want. Enjoy the brave new post-trial world to you explode. <laughs> that Monokuma disappeared, leaving us in even more leaving us even more confused than when he'd shown up. What? A new world? Could it be? Is he talking about a way to get outside? No, why I would he be? I wonder about that. That seems unlikely. Piece of shit! 
we don't know till we look. Hey. Whatever he meant, it seems we'll have to search the school me? one more time. Okay then, let's split up and start investigating. When you're done, everyone meet back up at the dining hall and we'll share what we've found. So basically, you're a one-trick pony. You're basically a one-trick pony, you know that? Got it. You're more like a staple food source. More like a staple food source. Now let's get moving. Seeing his words as their signal, everyone scattered and left the gym. Okay, I guess I gotta scatter and leave the gym as well. What the heck? What I'm talking about. I didn't notice anything at all. Hmm. We're serious. Got stuff like up there. Any god could come by and use it to send a message. Huh? I've been struck with knowledge to kill What? Let me out of here! You, you okay? 2D man? Um... Ordered. No! Hey Mondo, you always here. Yo. I want to check the metal hatch in the main hall just to be sure Dude, that shit. looks just like I figured it hasn't moved an inch. Yeah, I'd be surprised if he made things that easy for us. Hey, damn it. Hey. What? Or rather. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Don't make that face, you look like a... You, you wanna put on some fighting... You want me to put some fighting spirit in you? Well, do you? No thanks, I've got enough for now. Yo. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go look for another way out then. I know this isn't free time. Just in case, just in case I run by. Okay. Huh? Huh? Where's Talk? Talk is in here. Oh, I didn't see that. Standing. It's the stairs! Got it. You have stairs! Makoto, look! The gate blocking the stairs is gone! It would seem the path to the second floor has opened up. Me? But it's also of utmost importance to double check the areas we already know, just Without in case. Aren't I so clever to think of that? I, re I really impress myself sometimes. You understand? Well, I'll leave the school to you. Up the stairs I go. Man, I can't actually run upstairs. Dude, that's, that's kind of depressing. Second floor of the school. Maybe there's some kind of clue here. Yeah, I'm sure of it. There's got to be something here. Looks like water all over the floor. Anyone in classroom 2A? Anyone in classroom 2A? Anyone here? Oh. Baby is sleeping, please be quiet. Can I kill the baby with the knife? I see. This must be what he meant by a new world. Hmm. I should probably take a close look around. Um, well, I guess this is just... Yeah, but I don't really... I'm gonna 
monochroma coins could be. Oh wait, it's not like I need monochroma coins. Everything costs like one and I have about like, 80. I'm, I'm fine actually, never mind. Library? Who's in the library? Toko, because she writes books. Oh, I, he's looking, is he looking for manga, dude? Absolutely. <sighs> My disappointment is immeasurable. My day is ruined. <sighs> Damn it, I just spilled my drink on my left leg. Back to what I was saying. I'm absolutely shocked. How come? Damnation! They have all these books here, but not one copy of any of my works. <sighs> well, yeah, why would they have comics in the library? <laughs> why wouldn't they have manga in the library? Plus, most fanfic is just drawn by a bunch of amateurs. <laughs> oh. You just don't get it, not at all. <laughs> I do too get it. With a face like yours, anyone could tell nothing nothing you do is worthwhile. <laughs> ah! Douchebag. Say whatever you want about me, but never judge a book by its author. You know nothing! Now hear this, apprentices mean no appearances mean nothing at all. What you see before you is nothing more than a more than the rhyme that contains the meaty pulp of my genius. Here we go. My my creations are what determine my meaning and value. <laughs> so full of it. <laughs> hmm, I'm used to being misunderstood. You think weak attacks like yours drop my HP? He's an epic gamer weeb, man. <sighs> it's remarkably dusty in here and the lighting is less than ideal. For a library? It's not the kind of place I'd want to do much reading in. Skip over Byakia, I ain't talking to him. <laughs> Oh wait, mm -hmm. indeed, there are a plethora of books. It's true, but the content seems lacking. You know nothing! Where's the comic books? Where's the manga? Where's the young adult section? Huh? Comic book books? Young adult? That stuff's a waste of time. Hmm. 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 Uh, I'll try that again, I'll... I'll spit my drink out again, accidentally. Ugh. Don't speak with mouthful of water in your mouth. It's bad. I don't know why I didn't think of that previously. I've seen what you write, Miss Fukawa. Talented as you are, your stuff isn't any more worthwhile. What the heck? My stories are filled with true love and pure feelings. That garbage is nothing. Your writing doesn't even mean anything. It's just a bunch of jumbled up letters. Someone should just burn it all. <laughs> oh, the lady doth pro protested too much. The lady doth protested too much. Me thinks I bet. Me, met. Me thinks I bet. You're secretly in onto boy boy action. Oh no. <laughs> I don't care if it's anime or comics, comics or whatever. Uh, I'm telling you, it's all filthy. She doesn't say my anime. I'm skipping this shit. She just insulted my anime. Did you just insult anime, Toka? <coughs> Hi. Why would you do that to me? Why would you do that? Why would you do that? No! No, you just suck. 
Screw you, Turbo. But still, this library is most interesting. Now I'd much rather be Arkia than Turbo. I'd much rather talk to be Arkia than Turbo. Oh, huh, what's interesting about it? Stop talking. Oh, nothing. I was just thinking out loud. It's a laptop. So... It's broken. I tried pressing the power button earlier, but nothing happened. It's broken, huh? Too bad. I was hoping that I could use it to go online and see what's going on in the outside world. If it's broken, there's nothing we can really do about it. Nothing I can really do about it. The shelf is covered in dust, but on the shelf there's a letter. What's this? Oops, Indeed. Peak Academy? It was buried under a thick layer of dust. It must have been sitting there for quite a while. Well, shall we see what's inside? But we shouldn't read other people's mail and help us not right? <sighs> what we shouldn't do is leave this here without finding out what's inside. Okay. I broke the seal on the dusty envelope and pulled out a single sheet of paper I found inside. I unfolded the paper and read what's written on there. From Hope's Peak Academy Executive Office. Throughout the years, we have been committed to shaping your, the youth who will one day shape the world. We have a long, proud history as an institution of higher learning. With the government, with the governmental, governmental support, work. our grades enter society ready to take on active leadership roles in every major job field. However, Hope Speak Academy must now lower the curtain on its glorious history for the time being. This decision was not an easy one to make, but a series of issues beyond our control, I have made it necessary. But make no, but make no mistake, this, this is not the end for Hope Speak Academy. We intend to reopen our doors as soon as the issues forcing our closure have been resolved. That being said, this is the end for now. And I would like to, and I would like to personally and sincerely thank everyone for your help and support over the years. For now, we are awaiting official governmental for authorization, authorization, formally cease operate, to formally cease operations. What does this mean? Hmm. hmm, the contents of this letter are quite interesting. It would seem, it would seem Hope's Peak had stopped functioning, stopped functioning as a school. And judging by the amount of dust the letter had collected, it doesn't seem to have, re have happened recently. If I had to guess, I'd say this letter could be at least a year old. So you're saying Hope Peak Academy closed down at least a year ago? Most likely the mastermind took over the abandoned school in order to put on this little performance. But that would mean it was closed when I got when I got here just a few days ago. But I didn't get that sense at all. Plus, if the school had shut down, don't you think it would have been in all the newspapers and stuff? I mean, you're saying it could have happened over a year ago, right? But before, but before I got here, I looked up stuff online about the school and never saw anything about this. So in other words, 
it must have been all part of the Nuts Man's plan. They lured us all here. Lured, lured us. Lured, lured, lured us all here. Someone who can, someone who can create a place to judge and execute people could potentially be capable of anything. <laughs> of course, that's all assuming that this letter is real. However, if it is real, though, it does solve one mystery surrounding the school. The reason there are no other students here could be because the school is already closed down. <laughs> that would be a nice, simple solution. It's true. It's true. But then... Wait, what? But then what... But then what about this other part? Decision was not an easy one to make, but serious issues beyond our control have made it necessary. But no mis but make no mistake, this is not the end of which we had it. We intend to reopen our doors as soon as the issues forcing our closure have been resolved. What do they mean by serious issues? Ah, it's turd. Is there any connection between that and what's happening to us now? No. Uh. If the two events are in fact connected, uncovering that connection would be a useful clue on top of figuring out the mastermind's motive. Okay. Uncovering that connection would be a useful clue on top of figuring out the mastermind's motive. Although I, although I can't really say any more until we find more details. <laughs> So in other words, the mastermind only knows the truth. Only the mastermind knows the truth. The mastermind's motive. If we can figure out, if we can figure out why they would want to imprison us all here, what will be enough to get us out of here? Will will it be enough to get us out of here? Or or? Um, I don't want to complain. Okay, just... Okay, go. A pool? Dude, we got a pool? Just a second! Koda, hey, guess what? Guess what? I found a pool! There's a pool here! A pool! A pool! A pool! A pool! You don't have to keep repeating it, I got it. Okay! I'm gonna have an exercise equipment in the locker room. Sarko is gonna go nuts when she finds out. Yeah, you're right about that. Peter seems way more excited than usual. And... Did I work out of something like Yeah! Can I go fist fight Coco and be off with? Of course! Oh. Hmm. You'll have to swipe your personal e handbook across the card with the next to the door. Uh -huh. However, to ensure maximum security of these locker rooms, only a boy's handbook, which can get into a boy's locker room, can go to the door. That's the bottom line. Bye. But what if someone opens the door and then someone else comes <gasps> Anyone who commits such indecency will be punished without mercy for their scandalous... Yeah. See, there's a Gatling gun mounted on the ceiling, right? Yahoo! It'll be all... Do, do, do. Shooty shooty bang bang. It'll be all Just America. It'll be all America because it's shooting in a school. <laughs> I bet I'd, I bet it would really hurt to get shot by that thing. No, it wouldn't because you'd be dead. Instantly. Um. Um. Wait, wait. Ah! Um, no, I think it'd be a little worse than that. Hmm. But what happens if someone loans their handbook to someone else? A boy could borrow a girl's handbook and that would not, and that would get them into a girl's locker room, would it not? Ha! What? That never even occurred to me to think someone... Hmm. 
would could be so low, so cowardly, so devilish. Hmm? Hmm, okay, how's this? Sound? I got it! Time for a new rule. As of this moment, loading your e handbook to another study is strictly prohibited. <laughs> so, there. So now nobody can give their e no, so no, Now nobody can give their handbook to anyone else, right? Honestly. I did not imagine anyone would have would have lent their handbook out in the first place. Is that okay? After all, they would likely be held responsible for anything the person like that person might do with their handbook. So, um, but you know, it seems awful. You seem awfully concerned with all this locker room security. Of course. Well, you teenagers are maniacs. You're at that age where you try a plastic bottle. Um. Well, no, not too much. You're wrong about that. So to do it, so to keep anything unseen, unseemly from happening, I have to, I have to maintain a rigorous watch. <laughs> In that case, I would ask you to keep the same close eye on our dorms. <laughs> may decide to share a room and then nothing would be spoiling me. <laughs> All I care about is protecting the whole room because the school is so yes. yes. I don't care what happens in your private room, by force or coming, whatever you do, I don't know. Just the worst. I hate you so much. I hate you so much. See ya. So much. Okay, so the new regulation is in place. See ya. Ah, bye, Monokuma. <laughs> you got it! The gong is going to swim. The gong is swim. Uh, I'm sorry. Oh. Yeah, why are they going to swim? Swimming in pools is like the best. No, it doesn't only apply. Swimming's, swimming is epic. The swim is not competitive. If it's competitive, then it sucks. Because it's too competitive. Listen to me! Okay, ladies and gentlemen, how did it go? Did anyone discover anything interesting? Yes, indeed. There's a library. Okay. And a pool. A frickin' pool. And locker rooms filled with exercise equipment. There was, there was not, however, anything resembling an escape route. Yeah, she's right. I see. Well, hey, there's no reason for us to get all sulky. Wait till you hear about my amazing Quiet discovery. The warehouse and bathhouse on the first floor of the dorms are now open. You hear me? And the warehouse is off. <laughs> so go ahead and stuff yourself to the gills or whatever. Or whatever you feel like. Ha ha ha. Are you okay with this? Keep in mind, of course, that going out at night time is prohibited. Please do not forget. Yo. Okay. And what about and what about a fucking way out of here? Find anything find anything like that oh well um what there what? wasn't anything in the warehouse nothing to use to get our asses out of here nothing unfortunately no not that i saw hey come on ah oh, you fucking people what who gives a shit about a f fucking pool or a warehouse or whatever the hell stop fucking around oh censorship Censorship on one single word. And, uh, that's all the censorship you guys are getting. <sighs> We're still trapped in this piece of shit school. We need to find a goddamn way out. <laughs> now, now, there's no point in taking your anger out on us. Don't go take it out in that window over there and you can escape! God! It's obvious there's a huge window behind you and he's like staring at the window! It's right there! You piece of- It might be bulletproof glass, just get Sakura to punch it. It's Sakura, come on. 
<laughs> For now on, let's continue our investigation and let everyone know. Let everyone know if you should discover something. So then. So, are we done for today? Yeah. Well, yeah, I guess so. The air seemed to suddenly grow heavy. <clears throat> Was this the mastermind's plan? To give us hope and then just turn around and betray that hope? Dot dot dot. Why did I have to zoom in in Bjarke are saying dot dot dot? Ding dong bing bong, it's officially night time, woohoo. See that guy behind Bjarke? Could be a guy, could be a woman, who knows? Did I say Bjarke? I meant Monokuma. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm an idiot. Shine. Ding dong bing bong, it's morning, woohoo. Good morning, everyone. It is now 7 a.m. and nighttime is officially over. Time to rise and shop. Get ready to greet another beautiful day. Oh, that's right. I wanted to let you know that your e-handbooks have been updated. E-handbooks New updated? regulations have been added, so please... Didn't say free time. So... And just assuming that it's not free time. Assuming that it's not free time. But that isn't stopping me from trying to have free time. Knock, knock. Oh, yep, just go to the dining hall. Hey, Makoto. Yo, yo, yo. Still waiting on Yaki and Taka. Yaki is no surprise, but it's strange that Taka's not here yet. <laughs> Knowing Taka, I imagine he's trying to get the king of hardiness to get out of bed. <laughs> I'm sure they'll be here soon enough, just be patient. Let's see. I don't, I don't mind waiting for them, but there is one problem, which is, <sighs> I'm thirsty. The kitchen's right behind hey, you. Hey, come on. How the hell is that a problem? <laughs> Ifumi, would you make me some tea? Mm -hmm. Huh? <laughs> Milk tea, if you please. Well, why me? Let's see. The roundish figure, figure reminds me of the owner of the coffee shop I used to frequent. That's your reason? This is fine. I can feel my throat drying out. Quickly, please. Oh. Um. Okay. Why would you make him? Why would you do that, Celeste? <laughs> Thank you for waiting. The Fumi reappeared with the tray in hand. A gentle aroma grown stronger as he approached. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> you could have made something the rest of us, you know? There's no way to think about this in a common I, sense kind of way. I decline. I just decline. You're not my type war. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's the war of course. Yeah, that. Basic instinct. Act and react. <laughs> God. <laughs> well, that is not if you feel that mind. A small smile played across her lips as she, she held the teacup delicately in her oh. delicately in her hand. Wait. She cocked her head to the side. She threw the cup as hard as she could at the wall. Crap. What? What the? 
Okay, what are you doing with my little white rabbit? But that's a cop. I hate this kind of tea. Um, I don't understand. Yes, indeed. Imagine we are at a coffee shop. Just any normal everyday cafe, I sit down, order some tea. Then they ask me, would you like lemon or milk? Now further imagine that I replied, oh yes, I would like milk tea, please. In this small, in this case, along with the tea, they may bring me a small container of milk, yes? <sighs> but this is not for me. I am among those who prefer the milk to be part of the process from the outset. Calm down, dude. <laughs> it's just, you just put the milk in your tea, it's fine. Just kill it all. <laughs> oh God. You are like a totally different person just now. Oh, shit. Yeah, shit. Yeah, shit, you really want psycho there. <laughs> I knew there was more to her when I first met her. I'd hate to have her as an enemy. Did you see that metal thing she has on one of her fingers? She, she's just gonna like stab you with it, mate. The dining hall doors, the dining hall doors flew open and one of the late arrivals came storming in. But, Hmm. Bad news, everyone. There's a mystery afoot. Huh? Huh? What happened? <clears throat> it would seem Biakio refuses to leave his room. I stood there pressing his doorbell over and over and over, but he never showed himself. Maybe he just wasn't there. I think maybe... I'd like to think so, but I'm worried something might have happened to him. What he meant by that... He didn't have anything else to s He didn't have to say anything else. Everyone understood exactly what that might mean. It might be it might be a good idea if we all split up and go look for him. Listen to me! Oh, I was just about to suggest the same thing. What's your problem? Stop trying to one-up everyone. Um Okay, then I'll check his. I'll go. I'll check his room one more time. I'm just gonna keep hammering the button till I get a response. Genius. Well, Very well. I shall. The rest of us can go check out the rest of the building. Um. Yeah, before. Yeah, before it's too late. Be yeah, before it's you know too late. Got the box. Anyway, anyway, we just have to do our best to find Biakia. So where might Biakia have gone? Maybe he went to go check out the second floor of the school again. Take our ball. I have too many Discord messages. Yo. Where has it gone? Did you find him? No. Hey, come on. Shit, man. Where the hell did he go? He's got a head stuck so far as up his hot ass. No one knows what's going on with him. I figured maybe I was taking a bath or something. So did I! By the way. By the way, you a morning bath kind of guy? Hell yeah! My inbox. Don't mind me, my inbox is just dying. I'm gonna play for this server. Hot boy, which means you're up. Yeah, yeah. 
and the heart and, and the heat of your soul gets your heart and body pumping up. So thing, I'll oh, actually take your word for that. What? <gasps> what? What, you don't know what I'm talking about? Fucking nerd. Hell yeah! <laughs> Fucking nerd. Fucking nerd. Guys got it. No, no, they don't. Unless you just talk and mean like talking your to your bros. Wait, sure is not in? No? Damn, what are these Kyoto's in here? That's kind of depressing, not gonna lie. That's not what I wanted. Where am I? Is this a sauna? How did I get them in a sauna? How did I get them? Ah, oh, I thought that was the door, the exit door that I came through. All I did was go and knock on Bjarkeel's door though, so nothing that important. It's Kyoko! Hey. I thought you might come here too. Huh? So... Why do you think Yoko is Yoko is? He's in the library! Thank you, Kyoko. And looked inside. I cried out in sudden surprise. Yahia! He's reading. Dude! Oh! And you guys thought it was dead, didn't you? Haha. -ha. Of all the things I'd imagined. Of all the things I'd imagined. Oh god, let's get out of my eyes, chocolate wrapper. It's shining the light in my eyes and then my eyes are bleeding and I'm dying. Of all the things I'd imagined, this is most definitely, this most definitely wasn't one of them. Hey, uh, hey, uh what, are, what you are you doing here? Oh, wait, I'm fishing. fishing. What does it look like I'm doing? Oh, you're fishing, Yokia? I bet I could catch a bigger fish than you in your fucking little arms. I'm trying to read, so if you could be quiet. Oh, sorry. Wait, no! What are you doing here? <laughs> Everyone's super worried. We've all been looking Wait, for you. No. Who asked you to do that? Because. We're all supposed to meet up in the morning and eat together. I promise. Can't I get a second piece of quiet around here? Yo! <laughs> <laughs> Oh. 
Look at this for a second. that guy. Otherwise, this game of ours would be totally boring, right? 